Hey everybody, uh, we're working with the TriCaster Mini today and I'm trying to learn some of it and I'm going to work with you a little bit or show you a little bit of what's going on but not everything's going smooth for me because this is about the fourth time I've done this today and every time I record it, it goes to some place that I can't find it. Well, I just got done playing around again and I think I found it. So what we're going to do is I'm going to show you what's going on. Um, first of all, I'm going to go over and I'm going to give you a, a take so you can see what I'm looking at. This is my instrument panel, if you want to call it that. It's, it's our board. <coughs> Excuse me. Up here, it's camera number one. That's what you see right now. This is camera number two, which is in a preview down here. And then this board right here, this is my program out. And this is my preview. So if I hit... Uh, I'm going to hit take and it's going to switch. You're not going to see here. You're going to see me move over. So there it is. So that's that's the, the move. I'm going to come back over to the board again because I want to show you some things. So anyhow, these are all inputs that we can put cameras on. These are where DVRs are. This is DVR1. This is DVR2. That's where we store stuff. This is our graphics. MEs are downstream keys which uh, is far advanced for me right now. I'm just trying to learn how to do things. And in, that, in the um, downstream keys, we can do a green screen and put it on different sets. And, and that's what I'll be working on for the next couple of weeks. But right now, we are in uh, this mode here. Um, I'm going to take off of this. And what I'm going to do is I am going to come down here and I am going to start um, this one first. So when I click this, and then I come over here and I'm in DVR1, it puts it right there. So now DVR1's ready. I'm not going to play them all the way through, but when we do our shows, we usually put a five-minute buffer in and so that uh, people know that we're coming on. And this is one of the two starting videos that we have. I'm going to hit the auto button so you can see a transition. <laughs> Why do what you do right if we're trying to find it every time you get distressed? You should get tired of him, I'm on the man with him. Ain't gonna treat you right. Now every time I watch the TV, another soldier died. Another brother's gone. Another mother cries. But now I know the guy. Okay, now for everybody that's going to watch this. Basically what happens is when we go on our Thursday night shows, we have to go up to YouTube and Facebook and plug into those two units. And the funny thing is when you plug into Facebook, it goes on instantly like that. But when we go to YouTube, we have to put a time frame in. So we click in the time frame and we say it's going to be on at 8 o'clock. But when we do that, we because we clicked on it, we have to go and play something so Facebook can see something without just kind of watching us walk around and not doing anything. So that's what the beginning's for. And now I'm going to go back to the unit again. So I'm going to come over here. I'm going to go to this camera. You can't see that yet. I'm going to take a take. And now here's our, our setup again. <clears throat> now, basically, again, when I hit camera one, and I have it over there, that's what shows up. Camera two is what's sitting over here ready to go. I'm going to come down here now. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm going to go into the DVR. And now when I come over to DVR one, which is that's where that's located, DVR one is now sitting there ready to go up onto um, from preview to our actual program window. So this is a little something the that we shot uh, Sunday at the Festival of Speed. We got about four hours, got some great cars and everything else. I'm just going to run some real quick clips. You're not going to see them all as far as to the end, but you're going to see just a little bit. So I'm going to go now and I'm going to take and let's see what Brian has to say about the car that he's talking about. All right, we're at the Festivals of Speed at the Ritz-Carlton in Orlando, and Fred is with us, and it looks like we've found the Lotus area. So, Fred, tell us a little bit about 
your Lotus Elise that's here. Okay, so. Uh, so tell us a little bit about what's going on. Okay, so we are over here in the fountain area and we've got our three Lotuses. Um, we've got three different generations. This is a 2005 Elise. That's a 2010 Evora. And David's is a uh, 2000 V8 twin turbo Esprit. Beautiful car. Wow, the Esprit's, yeah, I remember. I wouldn't mess with the Esprit. I think it's a little quick. Probably weighs about uh, 14 to 1800 pounds and probably flies. <clears throat> but that's that's what we're looking at. So I'm going to go back over here and I'm going to come over to the preview window. And here we are at the preview window. And I'm going to come down over here now. I'm going to go over to the DVR2 side. And when I click over here on DVR2, that's what's going to come. Oh, you know what? You can't see that. So, I need to go here, and then I'm going to go back to where I was. I was over here, BVR1, that just got done playing. So now, I am going to come over here, I'm going to click this one, I'm going to click here to DVR2, and now DVR2 is what's going to come up next. <clears throat> Excuse me for my throat. I've only done five tries on this, and I'm starting to get a little bit on the wow side. But anyhow, so now when I press this button right here this is what's going to play so let's hit it all right we're out here at the festivals of speed at the ritz carlton in orlando and another car caught our eye this morning derek ames is here with a very special car and i'm going to let him tell you a little bit about it this is something that's uh, really pretty cool stuff so derek tell us a little bit about your car we've been working on this car for the past three years it's all totally fabbed up it's a sema build it'll be at sema 2019 427 okay so now You've seen another car that he's working on. I'm going to go back to my board and show you my board. So you can't see this, but right now I am going to hit the, I'm going to hit the take button because take is instant. Okay, so I'm instantly there. So here's my board again, and I'm going to go over this. This is program, and whatever's on this, this line right here is what's going out instantly. We have DVR1, DVR2, we have graphics, and we have ME's. The ME's are downstream, and the graphics are where you put like the names and stuff like that. Um, <clears throat> I have a lot of work to do yet to understand all of this. Uh, John's been doing it, and, and Lexa, and Shatira, and Sean, and they never let me play with anything, so I'm doing this behind their back, but don't tell anybody, okay? Because I gotta learn this. I feel like Mr. Left Out most of the time. So, there's our board. This is this is what's in preview, and it's the same. It's got the same numbers and same uh, letters on it as the one above it. Okay. So I am now going to go, and I am now going to come over and hit over here, and this happens to be in DVR one. So I'm going to click here. You're going to lose me up here. I'm going to hit DVR one, and that's what's going to play next. And I'm just going to hit take and let it go straight into take. So here we go into take, and I'll see you in just a minute. We're at the Festivals of Speed at the Ritz-Carlton here in Orlando, and another little car caught our eye. Rich is with us. Right. So why don't you tell us a little bit about this ride? This is a uh, one of 12 that was made in 1980. It's the seventh one that came off the assembly line. It's the only one they did a write-up on. It's the only one left in the United States. Uh, the rest are all gone. So when I put a... Okay, so now I'm back, and what I'm going to do is I am going to go over here, and I am going to put up camera number one. I'm just going to click on it this time. Well, I'll tell you what. Yeah, I'm going to click on it. All right, so now I'm here. So if you see right here, if I click this button uh, right here, like this, this is what's going to come up. Click that one there. So I can click right back and forth on it if I want, which is no big deal, especially the way I'm organized. Anyhow, now you've got all of this up here. If I click, <laughs> if I click this button here, this is our downstream information. And earlier today, um, I don't want that. Uh, let's go to, I'll tell you what, let's go preview here. All right, so this is what you see for a preview. And earlier today, and, it, and I did this yesterday because I was playing around on it yesterday. I saw take, I go, well, I'm going to hit take. Nothing happened. 
to take again nothing happened it, because it's doing all the stuff that's up in here if you watch you'll see these things my downstream keys going and I really don't have my downstream keys on so you can see them right here if you're watching they're turning back and forth but that's only that there I don't have that activated if you want to say you know why you can't see it but when I come down here and if I hit take then there I am and there's a board and you'll notice that this and this is like this now when I hit the key it's going to switch but you can't see it because when I let's see what happens when I hit auto tank let's see no nope, you can't see it okay so that's it I uh, I'm going to go over here to DVR2 let me go back over here so you can see it I'm going to go over here to DVR2 and I'm going to um, put uh, this is the other opening that we have, but I thought what the heck I might as well use it while I got it So there it is up there now this one here the other ones bands and this one's motorcycles So I, I'm gonna come over here, and I'm gonna hit now when I hit the auto the auto I can go right here and you can see this come up and uh, Let's pick a yo. Oh, let's do this one looks like a soft soft um, oval and so when I hit auto right here you should see a soft uh, switch so let's see what happens <laughs> start up the engines getting ready to roll gonna cruise on my bike now music to the soul kick stand up Boots are best, ain't gonna touch down till the road comes to rest. We're riding country roads, enjoying the day. We're riding for the love of the U.S. of A. So catch us. Okay, so there we are. Um, hopefully this works. I am going to stop recording now. I'm going to see if I can find it. And then once I find it, um, we'll go from there and uh, hopefully I'll have it up on uh, Facebook and YouTube today. So lesson number one of probably 400 lessons. Uh, I'm so proud of myself and I hope you people enjoyed it because I didn't screw up too much. So sit back, have a great day, and I'll see you on Facebook and YouTube. Bye.